One qualified with 12.51 representing GC Foster College, Tonian Lindsay. Lane number two won her semi final heat in 12.35 seconds, representing MVP Crystal Slowly. In lane number three, qualified with 11.68, representing Sprint Tech, Ramona Burchell. In lane number four, qualified with 11.76 seconds, representing the MVP track club, Shakoria Wallace. In lane five, qualified with 11.94, representing MVP, Kashika Cameron. In lane number six, she's coming off a season's best, 11.24, only a week ago, qualified with 11.82, representing Sprint Tech, Shashani Forbes. In lane number seven, she qualified with 12.11, representing Legacy Athletics, Jura Levy. And in lane number eight, qualified with 12.04, representing Racers Track Club, Jodine Williams. The lineup for the final of the women's 100 meters. The meet record, 10.86 seconds. Off they go for the women's 100 meters. Ramona Burchell is going well. Shakoria Wallace is also flying. It's Wallace who has the lead and Burchell trying to put her back. Wallace gets there, 11.16. Shakoria Wallace of MVP. Let's have a look at the wind speed. It's positive 0.3 meters per second. That is the personal best for Shakoria Wallace of MVP. 11.21 for Shashani Forbes. That's the season's best for Forbes, improving on the 11.21 that she produced a week ago at the John Woolman Speed Fest. And then in third position, Ramona Burchell coming through at 11.33. That's the season's best for her.